Hello. Welcome and thank you for attending this online abacus training. I am Parthis. I am going to train you abacus skills through fun games and practices. Are you ready? Hurrah! Let us start then. Abacus is a simple calculating tool. This is also called Soroban Abacus. Well, there are many benefits of abacus practice. Abacus helps to do calculations faster than the calculator. It improves the concentration and memory power. So it improves the school studies. It increases creativity and artistic senses. Have you seen Abacus Tool? This is Abacus Tool. Abacus has four parts. Vertical rods, beam, heaven or upper beads, and earth or lower beads. This tool has 17 rods. Each rod has one upper bead or heaven bead, four lower or earth beads, heaven bead worth five, each earth beads worth one. Rods represent place values. White dots represent unit points. We consider middle dot as one's rod, representing numbers 1 to 9. Left to the one's rod is tens, representing 10 to 90. Next to the tens is hundreds rod, for 100 to 900. Left is the thousands, next one is the ten thousands, so on. Let's look at the parts once again. There are some rules worth noting while using the abacus. These rules help speed and accuracy. Sitting position. Sit up straight at half the chair. Place feet on the floor. Do not cross the legs. Keep the abacus tool on the table one palm distance away from the edge holding the abacus hold abacus frame by left hand thumb and small finger use right hand thumb and index finger for beads movement use left hand index finger and middle finger for beads movement clearing the beads tilt the abacus vertically all earth beads are moved down Keep the abacus flat on the table. Run the right hand index finger, from left to right and push the heaven beads up. Now the abacus is set to zero. Try yourself to clear the beads. Before every EXC or size, first step is to clear the beads. Got it? Let's do it again. Cool. Let's move on. All right, it's time to count the numbers using abacus. We learned, upper bead equals 5. Each lower beads equals 1. Abacus takes value. When bead is moved near the beam, beads that are away from the beam takes 0. Now, no bead is near beam so abacus value is 0. Let's set 1. Move one earth bead up. Abacus is set to one. Move two earth beads up. It's two. Move three earth beads up. It is three. Move four earth beads up. It is four. Did you notice right hand thumb is used to move beads up? Yes, use right hand thumb to move lower beads up in this rod. 
and use right hand index finger to move down. Do it yourself. 0 1 2 3 4 Let us move on to 5. 4 5, move upper bead towards beam. Note, lower beads are away from beam. Let's do it again. 5. Did you notice, right hand index finger is used for upper bead? Let's set 6. Move one earth bead and heaven bead towards beam simultaneously. It's 6. Move two earth beads and heaven bead. It is 7. Move three earth beads and heaven bead. It's 8. 4 9. Move four earth beads and heaven bead towards beam. Another note, move beads together whenever possible. Let's do it again. 5 6 7 8 9 Let's play a quiz to practice the numbers 0 to 9. Ready. Find out the abacus value. This is 1, right. OK. Let's see the next one. How many are near the beam? 3 beads. So abacus has 3. Next, let's count the value of the beads. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, answer is 9. Next, 1, 2, 3, 4, it's 4. Now, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, it's again 9. This is 5. Isn't it? OK. Next is, 5. 6, 7. 8. Answer is 8. Let's count it, 1. 2, 3. Answer is 3. It's 5. 6, 7. 8. Answer is 8. Five, six. Answer is 6. Now move beads for the numbers given. First one is to set 6. Move upper bead and one lower bead near beam. 5, 6. OK. Next set 9. Move upper bead and 4 lower beads near beam. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Set 6 again. 5, 6. It's 1. Move 1 bead up. It's 2. Set 2 by moving 2 beads up. It's 8. 5, 6. 7, 8. Move bare beam. Set 3. 1, 2. 3. Right. It's 8 again. Move upper bead and three lower beads near beam. Set three. One, two, three. It's one. That's a fun. Isn't it?
Do you enjoy this fun? Yes, I too as much as you. Let's move on. So far, you know how to count numbers 0 to 9. Let's count the numbers 10 to 90. Tens rod is used to count 10 to 90. Look, beads are set from left to right. That is, tens rod first and then ones rod. Abacus is set 0. Let's set 10. Set 1 in tens rod. And 0 in ones rod. That is, no bead movement in ones rod. 1 0 equals 10. Move two earth beads up in tens rod and zero in ones rod. Two, zero. It's twenty. Set three earth beads up in tens rod. It is thirty. Move four earth beads up in tens rod. It is forty. Did you note? Left hand index finger is used to move beads up. Your guess is correct. Use left index finger to move beads up and down. Do it yourself. 0 10 20 30 40 Let us see 50 450, set 5 in tens rod. Note, lower beads are away from beam. Let's do it again. 50. Let's set 60. Move one earth bead and heaven bead towards beam in tens rod and zero in ones rod. It's 60. Set seven in tens rod. It is 70. Set eight in tens rod. It's 80. 490. Set nine in tens rod. Move beads together whenever possible. Let's do it again. 50 60 70 80 90 It's interesting, isn't it? Let's take a quiz to practice. Move beads for the number called 0 10 90 50 40 30 70 60 20 80 Are you able to follow? If you like to go through the beads movement again, you can do so. Great. Let's move on. We have seen counting 0 to 9 and 10 to 90. Combining these two, you can count 0 to 99. Let's count 10 to 19. 10. Move 1 in tens rod. 0 in ones rod. 1. 0. It's 10. 11. Move 1 in tens rod and 1 in ones rod. 1. 1. It's 11. 12. 13. 14 15 16 17 18 19 1 9, it's 19. 20. 2. 0, it is 20. 
same way you can set any number up to 99 using 10s and 1s rod. Let's see some more numbers. 32 21 43 54 65 76 87 99 All right, we have come to the end of this class. Today, you have learned how to hold the abacus tool, method of moving the beads and moving the beads for 1 to 9. Points to remember. Beads near beam takes value. Heaven bead is 5. Each earth beads is 1. One's rod to count 1 to 9. Ten's rod to count 10 to 90. Ten's rod and one's rod together are used to count 1 to 99. Practice is the key for improving all your skills through abacus learning. So, practice 0 to 99 every day 15 minutes till next class. Have a good time.